Hi guys. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Um. What I'm gonna do? Not a review of Batman Seventeen. The movies. Uh, um. Very, very good ending to um, Death of the Family arc. Uh, yeah, it's just. It, it, it asked me on edge in a couple pages in, especially when uh, at, the, um, at the table with all the um, Batman and Nightwing and Red Hood, Batgirl, Damon. Yeah, just. That bit just. Oh, geez. he had me, but and it turned out to be, you know, some bit that weren't when I was expecting. I, I thought it actually happened, but as it turned, it was. Uh, uh, but, uh, I, I'm not going to say what what happened or because I, I don't want to spoil it. I'll, I'll I'll leave it to you guys to read it. Um, but that bit is at me on edge, honestly. So I was like. Oh, no, oh my god. Basically, shit. Oh, fuck, you know. But, uh, yeah, um. Very good issue, honestly. It's just. I, I never had. Not this level of excitement for a comic. But Superman's different. Cause I, I love Superman. It is, that's different. Cause Every time I read a Superman comic, I I look forward to it. But a Batman comic, mm. I, I I don't really read Batman comic, not pre fifty two, not occasionally like graphic novels stuff like that. But I will read them, but not in comic. Like you get them every month, you know, in every time. So uh, ever since the new fifty two started, I I picked up Bert issue and so on, and. This is the first time that I got really excited. I couldn't wait to read a Batman issue. Uh, it, it's just so good. Uh, I, I, I recommend you to, to read it. Especially if you read all the um, Death of the Family arc from I think it was issue 13. Yeah, it started there. And then uh, ever since Joker returned, it was thought. Suspense after suspense. What what's gonna happen? What's he gonna do? What was he done to this person? Or is this what gonna happen? It, it, is it, it this will, will this happen or will he not? It is is it maybe it's just the world just you know boring us or it's, it's it gets me it gets you thinking what what's what's basically what's happening? What what's gonna happen? Mm. Oh, uh, uh, it's so good. Um, the ending, it's um the, the end of the year uh, issues um kind of left it um hanging. I, I personally, especially with the the Joker, the end of the Joker, um I I I, I don't know what's going to happen because it, it feels like they left the door open for him, you know, the future. You know, like my hands. You know, you know what the Joker's like. So I, I think that left the door open for him to come back. Not you know in later stories. Well, obviously you can't just kill him off all the time. So yeah, one year, no Joker, and he returned in issue thirteen. I think September last year. So just 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 to have him for the past five issues, and it's just kill him off. So. No, he wouldn't do that. So I'll, I'll say it's like um, we won't be see him, see him uh, for a while now. I, I reckon it, it's gonna be like give the spotlight to other villains like Riddler stuff like that. So, so I, I, I think he will return, just not for a while. So, um, the ending, the um, the actual ending for the comics, um. Basically, all, all the um, all the people in the in the comic. Um, I'm I'm trying not to say who survives or dies, but I'm not saying anything. I'm just I'm t um, it's hard to explain because it's I don't want to spoil people. Um, 
they, they get to a, a, a kind of um sort of depressed level because basically they've been hurt by the Joker, you know. I, I think it's trauma's toys, something like that. So um, it'd be interesting to see how the next issues from eighteen to twenty, something like that, to see how they feel not like, after. The event of the um, death of the family and um, how it, how, how is it um, affected them? Because Bat Girl's mother has got, you know, tortured by the Joker basically. So, so um, to see how Barbara Gordon's reaction to that and um, how it affects her and um, you know how she's feeling after all this. So it's the same all the them um, all, all the alloys that. Well, being in, you know, I'm not gonna say, but you know, people like them. So um, it's very good. And yes, he had me on there. It's, he had me. Oh, he's Scott Snyder. It's oh, you had me. Or not very good issue. Pick if you haven't picked it up, pick it up. What's the matter with you? Pick it up. Um, let's just have a read and. Um, so what, tell me what you thought and just for a comment on, you know, down there. So, so. Just tell me what you thought and um, did you like it or did you like it? Did you like how it ended or did, did you like how it happened? Um, just tell me. Um, so, yeah, very good issue. Yeah, so, oh, just, it was so good. Um, well, that's it then, um, Batman 17. So um, I, I I picked up other comics I will be reviewing probably tomorrow. I, I just wanted to review this one first, and I'll do the rest tomorrow. Um, so I picked up Superboy. It's um, Hell on Earth. It's the last issue for Superboy with that storyline. So cause it's Supergirl and then Superman. That's the last one. So um. Yeah, very good. I'll, I'll review that tomorrow. Um, <coughs> Batman Robin. So it's basically it is set in after Death of the Family. So after Batman Seventeen. So read Batman Seventeen before reading that. And same for um, Batgirl as well. You have to read Batman Seventeen before reading them too. Okay. Um, I finally picked up Green Arrow. I heard everyone talking about it, and it's so good. So I wish I picked it up last week, so I finally got it now. So I will do a review of that tomorrow. Um, and that's it, really. I, I bought um graphic novel, the um, Night of the Owl. I, I, I won't review that. So it's too many to review. So, so, uh, so um, yeah, I'll just do these tomorrow, in these four. And... um. I hope you enjoyed the video. Oh, it was so good. It's just so good. Just read it. Oh, see ya.